Heavy rain alert in Himachal Pradesh. Extremely heavy rains battered the hill state, triggering landslides and flash floods. Cloud burst, inundating many areas, washing away roads, vehicles and houses. All major rivers are bringing a normal life to the standstill, uh, overflowing, flooding. Frightening images of the chaos unleashed by the rain has emerged. Bias River is flowing above the danger mark. Temples and other structures submerged on the banks by swollen rivers. Gurdwara Shri Manikaran Sahib was also devastated by a massive landslip. Several bridges in Himachal Pradesh have collapsed as rains wreaked havoc across state. A red alert has been sounded off as the hill state remains worst impacted by intense rainfall over North India. Sir, based on the briefings you've received, what's the situation? Which are the worst affected districts? The Kullu Manali is the worst affected district of Himachal Pradesh. All our uh, all our districts are worst affected. Losses are uh, life loss, uh, human loss are about 16, and total uh, damage caused due to rain is heavily. हम पूरी रात पे भी आज दो बजे भी हमने कोई 30 people को सुकु जी क्या कौन सा डिस्ट्रिक्स है हिमाचल में जो आपने और आपके एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन आईडेंटिफाई किया है एस द वर्स्ट अफेक्टेड अभी है आई हैव ऑलरेडी टोल्ड यू कुल्लू मनाली इस तरह से कुल्लू इस तरह और अभी जो रेड अलर्ट इश्यू किया है सुकु जी इस तरह कंसर्न दैट बिकॉज़ ऑफ दैट द सिचुएशन व Twenty nine को हमने मनाली से वैक्यूएट किया पूरी रात को वैक्यूएट सुबह चार बजे किया अगर वन ऑफ द मिनिस्टर इस बियर मिस्टर सुंदर ठाकुर वन ऑफ द मिनिस्टर इस बियर वो वहाँ है और अभी पूरी रात अभी फिर तेज बारिश हो रही है हमारा सभी Actually, this high alert has come to us yesterday and we had to do it for the most important work. We have rescued 8 people in the pond, who have reached the water of the pond. We have been able to get out of the SGRF. And in the whole area, we have rescued about 15 people in the area. And we have sent them to the place of the place. I am also seeing the people who are watching here. We have so much difficulty in removing them. I think they should really think hard about valuing their lives. Torrential rains have wreaked havoc in Himachal Pradesh and majority of the rivers are in spit. We are in Mandi where we can see the Solan Bias River with where the flood water has almost touched the residential areas, be it the temples or be it the houses. People have been moved to the safer places after the flood water entered their houses, be it the Thunag or be it the Pando area. These areas experienced floods after the flood gates were opened by the dam administration. As far as the alert is concerned, the Met Department has predicted rains till 13th of this month. Flood water has entered the residential areas and scared the local residents. That is why the administration has asked people now to venture the low-lying areas, the river beds and the highways where shooting stones can take place. As far as the impact of the rains is concerned, public and private pot property worth several hundred crores has been damaged during the torrential rains. With camera person Aman Gupta, this is Manjit Sagal in Mandi for India today. Flash floods have wreaked havoc in many parts of Mandi. We are at the Solikhar area where we can see how the flash flood and the rains have damaged this property. We are standing at the third story and all three stories have been damaged by the flood water which suddenly entered this house around 3 a.m. The owners of this building are still living in this building on the top floor just watching how the flash floods have wreaked havoc and damaged their hard-earned property. This is the second story. We cannot move even as there is sand and it is slippery. We, the flood water can still be seen in the first story of this house. This is how the flash floods and torrential rains have wreaked havoc in this area of Mandi district. With camera person Aman Gupta, this is Manjit Sagal in Solikhad area for India today. We don't have any other place to go to. We 
जितना हम बचा सकते हैं थोड़ा बहुत हमने बचा लिया है अभी हम घर की तीसरी मंजिल पे हैं हमारी दो मंजिलों में तो रेत और पानी से मतलब बहुत ही बुरा हाल है और अभी चौथी मंजिल पे हैं वैसे तो और देखते हैं अभी क्या हो सकता है जी ये बताइए कि इस क्षेत्र में कितने घर तबाह हुए बाढ़ में ये तो पार मंगाली के तो हो गए छह सात घर हाँ जी तो यहाँ पूरे दो मकान भी चले गए पानी पूरे मकान में हाँ जी दो हमारी है काम वाली उनको भी परेशानी हो गई बहुत ज्यादा प्रकृति का अपना नियम है जब हम लोग खनन ज्यादा करेंगे तो फिर भी लापन प्रकृति है जैसा करोगे वैसा भरोगे आज तक इतनी ज्यादा नहीं आई थी लेकिन इस बार बहुत ज्यादा जो बढ़ गया इस बार ब्यास का तो अपने रुद्र रोक में आ गई है ज्यादा देर तक यहाँ रुके रहे तो जान माल का खतरा हो सकता है इसलिए प्रशासन भी यहाँ पे लगा हुआ है कि यहाँ पे ज्यादा लोग नहीं आए और अपने घरों में सुरक्षित रहे डर का माहौल तो है जो नीचे वाला एरिया है ना उनमें ज्यादा दहशत है और वहाँ ऊपर से पहाड़ी से पत्थर भी है नीचे लोग मानते नहीं थोड़ा प्रशासन लड़ रहे हैं ना स्थिति के लिए पहले पहले लड़ रहा ना चाहिए अपने प्रशासन को The furious torrential rain in Himachal Pradesh has literally caused mayhem in several districts. Here in Mandi, the ground situation is the water level of river Bias has gone up. Since yesterday, it was even touching this iconic, more than a century old, this foot over bridge. However, the water level has reduced, but the rise in the water level is all because of the Pando Dam gates that have been opened because of the overflowing the water level and all the hilly to hilly part. Hilly region has been totally covered with thick layer of crowd, and there have been non-stop rain in certain areas. And if you see this, these images, the scary images of Bias River, this is literally taken away, washed away, number of uh, foot over bridge all over in this area, be it Sundar Nagar or Mandi. Several cars were seen in the viral images, washed away, flown away with this water level by. Vyas River and here in Mandi, that's a Shankar Temple, Dharamshala. All these areas, everything is now inundated, submerged, which are just located at the bank of River Vyas. This is the furious situation in Mandi. There has been red alert issued. The schools, colleges are shut down. People have been warned not to venture out near the river areas, as more likely there will be landslides. And of course, since the rainfall continues, there will be further rise in the water level of. These furious Bias River. In Mandi with Nasir Ahmad Shatrush Mishra for India Today.